Today I'm going to show you how to use the qualifier, or the color picker, what I call it. Now if you haven't seen the videos before, I suggest watching that first because I will show you how to get to this stage where you're able to use the qualifier, but right now I'm going to show you how to use the qualifier and what it can be used for and what it's important is. So what I'm going to do is grab this and I'm going to pick one of the colors that I want to use. Maybe it's this one. And there we go. That looks kind of bad. But I can choose the green color right here. I'll turn off the saturation, turn off the hue. Basically, that's how you use it. It's pretty self-explanatory. You have the filters, the pre-filters, blah, 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 blah. If you want an in-depth look at it, I use it in my orange and teal breakdown of the YouTube look. So I recommend going and watching that video because here this image doesn't work that well for it. So now I am just picking out this area of green. And what we can do is invert it. This is how you invert it. And now we have everything that is not green inverted. And the pre-filters, you can clean up the blacks. These are just to clean up the image because as you can see, it's very noisy, which is one of the reasons colorists don't use this. But for the most part, it's kind of the same as the windows. You're basically making a window with the color, the luminance, or the saturation. So I can up the gain like that if I wanted to. I can completely change the color if I wanted to. But if you want to learn a better way of doing this, I suggest watching my orange and teal look. I went back in and showed some examples of what the qualifier can do and how it can be used. And I kind of made the greens more green. And it looks pretty good. I was kind of trying to rush through it before, but this is how it should look. So I hope you like this B-roll of that. And after this step, I would go and use the color warper. So if you want to learn about that, watch this next video here.